Ridley, please. Okay, Organs Trail Director's Cut. If you guys want to, like, um, tweet stuff out, you know, saying, Hey, look, Dobie's gonna play a stupid game because he sucks at video games. Except don't really say it like that. Anyway, let's try this out. Options. Let's... Put the click volume down, I guess. On the road Twitter prompt? Okay. Control scheme. Okay. Extras. Mm no. Okay. Let's just do campaign. Oh, sorry, I didn't uh I didn't make the screen bigger. Thank you for pointing it out before I started playing the game. I am dumb. Explain the differences in difficulty. The difficulty you pick will determine the amount of supplies you can scavenge at the start of your journey. It also affects enemy difficulty and event occurrences. You are rewarded for choosing a higher difficulty with a score modifier. Uh-huh. So I should start off with suicide, right? Right? Yeah, sure, why not? Also refresh the page in case the screen is like really, really, really lagging. Click on the enemy and draw a line towards yourself to shoot. Wow! This is, um... Interesting. Oh god! What is going on? Thank you? Well then, it looks like I just saved your bacon. I reckon we stand a better chance out there if we stick together. My name is Clements. I used to be a priest. Not much use for those nowadays. No, if you used to be a priest, your name should be Wolfwood. What's your name, partner? My name is I'm Gonna Die. This pleasure's all mine, I'm gonna die. Listen, even with the two of us, we won't survive very long. Everyone I trusted died a while back. Do you know anyone we could count on in a pinch? Nope! Oh, I can just click people? Let's see, who do I want to die along with me? Let's go with, uh... You're gonna die along with us? And... Uh, I'm sorry, Cloudy. And I guess Christy, too. Well, we're all gonna die, but at least we'll die happy. And <laughs> make it the graphics ugly. And the last person's gonna have to be John. He's gonna have to die, too. There's a good... <laughs> There's a good chance if they're still alive, they'll be back at the shelter set up in D.C. If they have any sense, that is. We're gonna need a way to get around. I saw an old station wagon a few blocks back. Those things might not be very reliable, but you'd be surprised how roomy they are. Anyway, let's get moving. Okay. Dying tastes like purple. Use the WASD or arrow keys to move. Oh joy, oh rapture. I feel like I'm playing a game on the, my old... Uh, uh, what, what computer was it? It was a, um, Macintosh... God, this is from the 90s. That, like, old Macintosh computer that was out before Windows, uh, like, became popular. This had to be 1996 or so. It was sucked. Alright, I think I got enough, just enough fuel and food for us to make it back to TC in this baby. Let's hit the road, I'll drive. You know what this is? This is TurboGrafx-16 or something. Okay, so I'm gonna die station wagging in Clements. That's wonderful. Clements is a broken. How the hell did you break your arm, Clements? We're in a freaking car driving at two miles an hour. What the hell? If only John were here to see us killing him. Someone tweet at John and tell him he's gonna die. Clements, how the hell did you get dysentery? We just drove for another two minutes. My god. Clements, you're gonna die! Oh, we're almost at DC. Am 
Clemens. Clemens. We're in a friggin' car. How did you get bitten by a zombie? I'm not even asking. We are just all the bad luck. Oh, Washington, D that's pretty much what it looks like today. Okay, maybe the graphics are just a bit worse than the real Washington, D.C., but you know what I mean. Just as the station wagon runs out of fuel, you coast into the city. You can hear radio, radio blaring in a nearby window. Repeat, all survivors who still remain in Washington, D.C., the government has declared a Class 3 biohazard. Oh, God, we're playing Resident Evil. They will be co commencing a nuclear strike within a few short hours. Get out while you can. The city is lost. Isn't this the plot of Resident Evil 2? Looks like we have a time problem. I'll go look for your friends at the shelter. No, you were bitten by a zombie. You go you go away before you turn to a zombie. Meanwhile, you should go scavenging for supplies. I've heard about a place on the west coast that's supposed to be a safe haven from all this chaos. Let's meet back here and head out. Here, take my journal. I've written down everything I know about surviving on the road. Should help you decide what you think we may need on the trip. Okay, fine. <laughs> Dude, I wanna open this window while you just No no I thought you dumbass <laughs> Clement break breaks his arm. Okay, pick up the supplies you wanna gather. Hours remaining four. Um okay. Oh I see. Let's get some fuel I guess. Um let's get some ammo, food, and a med kit. We can only get four things. That sucks. <laughs> Your friends join the party. Oh yeah, it's party time, guys. Let's get out the disc. Oh, not that kind of party. Great, everyone's here. There's just one more thing. Back there on the road, one of those things bit me. I'm already not feeling too well, and I can't stand the thought of becoming one of them. You're gonna have to put me down. Oh god, no, you're not a puppy. No, Clement, no, no. Why don't you just keep my journal? It may help you out there. Good luck. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm gonna die. Put down Clement. That is that is good. Oh, and I can tweet this out. That's awesome. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Let's go to Pittsburgh, guys. <laughs> What happened? Okay, nothing happened. Awesome. You find some roadkill. It's probably safe to eat. Oh yeah, guys. Gonna have some roadkill. Let's see. Uh, some uh, turtle pancakes. Some... Uh... Oh no, this is skunk. Ugh, I hate skunk. The only water you can find is sludge from a runoff drain. You reluctantly drink it. And we all lose health. <laughs> you hit a pretty nasty bump in the road and 30 what why the hell do you have the windows open in a zombie ridden apocalypse dude dude why no what why were you know what you know what miffin I, 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 that had you written all over it, okay? You were just, you were like, you had all the bullets in your hand. You were just like, look, look, I can juggle! And then we hit the bump, and the, the flew out the window, and you're like, but the window's closed. No, the window's not closed. <laughs> because Clement broke his hand through the window five minutes ago. And then got bitten by a zombie because he still had his arm sticking out the window. And now you're juggling your ammo by the window. And we lost it. Good job. <sighs> God, this, this... You know what? I have to play this game with, uh, with other people. I need, uh, I need other people in the car. Seriously? Seriously, Ben? Seriously? You get the measles? Didn't you get your shots as a kid? Come on. Come on, Ben. Come on. Oh, we're at Pittsburgh. That that looks like Pittsburgh, yeah. 
Um, ooh, party. No, it's not that kind of party. I already made that joke. So what kind of jobs do we have here? There are a couple of troublemakers who've been stealing from us. Dispose of them. Uh... Okay, let's do the normal difficulty thing, because I'm already on suicide difficulty. Pull back to aim release to shoot your vulnerable while aiming and so is the enemy. Come on, come on. Wow, my aim sucks. Come on, bandits, it's the zombie apocalypse. Oh yeah, okay. This game has like the best graphics ever, by the way. Wow, how did that not kill me? Okay, seriously? How do I keep missing this guy? Damn. Yes, I survived the attack. <laughs> Claustrophobic, he's afraid of Santa. Yes, I have to put my headphone back in. I earned two scrap, what the hell does that mean? Uh, auto shop. An upgrade? Radio. How the hell does the radio- No, I'm not even gonna bother asking. What can I sell? Scrap. One dollar. Wonderful. Wonderful. No. You know what? You know what? No. We're just gonna leave. We're getting out of here. <laughs> you must cross a horde of zombies in order to continue on the road. The horde is in front of you, currently large in size, it appears to be agitated. Uh, wait to see the horde disperses, break out guns, a clear path, attempt to sneak through. Okay, let's get information. You can attempt to- you can't go over it, you can't go around it, you have to go through it. You can attempt to sneak through the horde. If the zombies aren't very aggressive looking, you might be able to slowly drive through them without drawing their attention. You can also fight your way through. A large and angry horde may still be able to overwhelm the vehicle. If they're mercenaries, you might be willing to protect you for a nominal fee. Uh, let's attempt to sneak through. What's the worst that could happen? Okay, zombies are having a sweet rave party. I think this is going well, guys. Just let- Oh yeah, we made it through the zombie rave party. High fives all around. High fives. Hi. High five. High five. No? Okay. Okay, no. That's fine. You don't have to. 200 miles to the mall. Oh my god, we get to like, go shopping. Oh my gosh. You suddenly find your- God damn it. Oh no, zombies, no, why? Okay, sir. Uh... Well, god damn it. Station wagon was weakened. It was damaged. Station wagon has more health than the rest of us. Looks like something interesting is happening off to the side of the road. Okay, fine. What's happening? You enter a small police station. There are a few bodies on the ground and dried blood on the walls. You hear a gentle voice coming from one of the jail cells. You there! Would you do me a favor? Sure. I just need you to give me a piece of that zombie over there. He points at one of the police officers whose head is missing from his shoulders. They put me in here for biting people. I don't have the disease, but I wish I did. I'm not a bad person. I just recognize the new world order and want in. <laughs> uh, I, for one, am going to welcome our new zombie overlords. It's not like I can hurt anybody from in here. I'll just be eternally at peace. Immortal. I can tell you where they kept their ammunition. Okay, fine. 
You move the body closer to him, and he snaps a finger off the officer. Thank you! Here, use his keys to get in the top drawer on the left! He throws the keys and walks to the edge of his cell. He appears quite content as he sits down on his cot and places the infected meat into his mouth. You leave him to himself and fish out the ammo. Everybody wins. You spend some time cleaning guts out of the car. I'm sorry that I shot Clement when I was in the car, okay? It was a bad idea, I admit that now. I'm so I didn't see- uh, you know what? Your fault, not mine. Let's blame John, he's not here, we could just blame everything on John. Ooh, it's the mall, a heavy fog rolls in, you're forced to drive more slowly. Yay! <laughs> left to die instead of left for dead. Get it? Get it? Ugh. I'm sorry. Okay, so we're at the mall. Oh, there's the guy from Resident Evil 4. Welcome, stranger. What you buying? What you selling? I'll buy it at a high price. Okay, no. What's our jobs? Uh, there's a large number of zombies just outside my home. Uh, I don't think so. Let's supply. Let's try a scavenge. You W A S D and or the arrow keys. Okay. Er. God damn it. I got ten dollars though. Let's just get the hell out of here. Okay, we're heading to Indianapolis. John! Oh god. We're out of food. Uh... The sky clears up, yay. Is that like, what kind of stop is that? Okay, we're out of food, wonderful. It starts raining heavily, you have to drive slowly. Ah, John. You gotta scavenge. Ah, damn it. Is this food? No, that's not food. Boss fight? Why? What? Why? 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 No! 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 Derek. John is the water eighth. Damn you, surprise boss fight! Seven AM Ah, oh, God, get out of my face. How does this even like how does this work anyway? I don't understand like how I can get out of out of the scavenging. This is not going well at all. Here lies I'm gonna die. Yes.
I tweet this? Oh, hey. That's kind of cool. That's wonderful.